Susie Tomasi went missing nearly five years ago. Tonight, we're breaking down the timeline of her disappearance. But first, we want to get right to our WPTV's Cameron Eppinger. He is live at the or near, I should say, the Oslo <laughs> River boat ramp in Vero Beach, where those remains were found earlier today. Cam. <clears throat> Yeah, honey, I'm here along Oslo Road, about half a mile from the Oslo Road boat ramp, which has been closed uh, since earlier this afternoon. You can see we got some crime scene tape, some cones, and you see that sheriff deputy with his uh, flashing lights. This has been the scene. This has been what it's looked like uh, since earlier this afternoon. Uh, when detectives and deputies, they got a call from a fisherman. He called to report that he had found some human remains in this area. Now, we're told those remains were located deep in the mangrove tree coastline, about 150 50 yards north of the boat ramp. Now, based on some personal items that were also found, detectives believe they are possibly the remains of Susie Tomasi. She's a 73 year old woman from Vero Beach, and the family says she suffers from dementia and she was last seen getting into a white pickup truck not far from where we are now along US 1 and Oslo Road. After today's discovery, Sheriff Eric Flowers released the following statement on social media, and it reads in part, quote, I personally met with the Tomasi family this afternoon as we hope to bring closure to them and our community members, many of which searched alongside our agency for Susie over the past five years. End quote. Now back out here live, just to be clear again, we're about half a mile from uh, that Oslo Road boat ramp, which is behind me, which is currently an active investigation underway. We're told by sheriff deputies that that boat ramp will remain closed until further notice. For now reporting live in Vero Beach, I'm Kimara Leppinger, WPTV News Channel 5. Hani. Cam, thank you. We, of course, covered the search for Susie Tomasi heavily when she initially vanished. We've also followed up on her disappearance through the years. Our WPTV anchor Tanya Rogers breaks down the timeline of her disappearance. Susie Tomasi was 73 years old when she was last seen walking away from her family's restaurant on March 16, 2018. Less than a week after her disappearance, Tomasi's family offered a $5,000 reward for information. On March 21, 2018, dozens of volunteers searched the Oslo Riverfront Preserve. That's the same area where Indian River County Sheriff's deputies say skeletal remains were found on Friday. Just under a month after Tomasi's disappearance, her family announced that they were increasing the reward for information to $10,000. Several months after Tomasi was last seen, her husband Patrick announced he was closing his well-known restaurant called The Quilted Giraffe. Patrick said the memories of his wife at the restaurant were just too much to bear. He owned the business for seven years. The case then went cold for more than a year. On October 30, 2019, surveillance video from a nearby business was released. At this point, deputies thought it may have shown Tomasi getting into a white truck. Investigators with the sheriff's office say they followed up on more than 100 leads, but did not have any success. Now a fisherman may have discovered skeletal remains. You can download the WPTV News app for updates on this breaking story. You'll also find links to all of the archived stories we've done on Susie Tomasi since her disappearance there. You can also scan the QR code you see on your screen right now or search WPTV in your app store.